Captain Carson, it was quite a shock. I can't understand why anyone would murder poor George. Especially when the suspected killers were boys. Boys? Yes, Mr. Galt, the evidence points to cadets Collins and McKay again. Nonsense, Carson. Well, George Bolton was the best friend those boys had. Carson speaking. What? Headed across the lake toward the border? The radio the lake patrol to keep a lookout for them. Four cadets answering the description of Collins and his friends were seen leaving the main wharf in a speedboat. boys were wearing the well-known khaki-colored uniform of the Elliott Air School. Two of them were wearing mechanics coveralls over their uniforms. That means we'll have to ditch these clothes and get some others. But where? They'd turn us in the moment we walked in the store. Say, we've got plenty of clothes at Mr. Bolton's. It's our only chance. We'll hide out in the warehouse basement and watch our chance to sneak in. I still can't believe those cadets would kill George. Why, he was the best friend they had. He took them off the streets, gave them a home. I agree with you. There's something about these murders that doesn't seem quite right. There's more behind them. You mean you don't believe the boys are guilty? I don't know. Mr. Gold, what do you know about Ankerbond? Ankerbond? Well, seven of us went to Africa in search of the caves. One of us, Professor Mason, whose daughter met him at the car, disappeared without a trace. Mm-hmm. Nothing more? Mm-hmm. Nothing other than the fact that we never found the caves. Why do you ask? Because, Mr. Galt, you were the only one of those seven men still alive. Yes, I've thought of that, and I'm taking precautions. But surely you don't believe... I believe all these murders have some connection, and Anchor Bond is the only clue that ties them together. But three of the men were killed by the Black Hangman. Does it ever occur to you that these boys might be working for that Nazi spy? Yes, it could be. It's a favorite Nazi method to persuade misguided youth to do their dirty work for them. 
Well, my theory might sound fantastic, but if you see any of those boys... I'll let you know at once, of course. So, uh, where can I get a hold of you? Headquarters? I'll be here for several hours. I want to look over Bolton's papers very carefully. to meet the Schwarzer Hanker. In that same alley on Front Street. Oh, must be making another visit to Bolton's. But why? Bolton's been disposed of. Yes, but the Schwarzer Hanker still believes Bolton had that charter of anchor bond. Let's hope he finds it. Yes, Ron. When he does, he will have put the news around his own neck. And we will be promoted for our great service to the Reich. Mark the car in that alley. If I'm not there in ten minutes, come through this basement to Bolton's workroom. There it goes. Pardon the mistake, Herr Kapitan. I was told I would find him here. Mr. Gault left some time ago. That is fortunate for him. It gives him a few more minutes to live. You see you were looking over the papers of Herr Bolton, nine? Perhaps you found something my accomplices overlooked. Accomplices? Yeah, the four cadets for whom you and the police are so futilely searching. Cadets, eh? And you admit you were associated with the boys in the murder of Bolton? He was dangerous in my mission to the Reich. Why? He had nothing to do with war production? Or could the connection be... Ankerbahn? Ankerbahn? Why do you say that? These uh, maps and this chart I found. Over to them, then they'll know we didn't kill Mr. Bolton and Major Elliott. Okay, but first I want to see what this guy looks like. Don't touch him. Trap those guns. Lay down on the floor. Face it down, all of you. Young cooks, 
it took you long enough to get here. You're lucky we got here at all. No, Ram. The police will take care of them for us. Tie them up. Police headquarters. This is the Black Hangman. Yeah. The young cadets who assist me in eliminating the heads of your war industries, you will find tied up in Bolton's office. I have no further use for them. Did you find the chart to hang about? No, I did not. Hey, Danny. What is it? I got a pair of wire cutters in my right hip pocket. If you can reach them, I can. Get up now. Did you make what they had cost him? Don't be ridiculous. I left him alive to protect Mr. Gold, the eminent patriot. From the black hangman and the cops who took care of the kids. Mr. Carson has information that they're traitors working for the black hangman. That should leave us in the clear. Yes, we can now work without any interference from the police while they waste their time convicting those cadets of murder. Where to? Drop me off to pick up my car. Then go out to the airport to get Tanner. He's bringing in my other plane. Did you fellas hear what they said about this chart? Sure, but what if they did find it? It's a fake. Yes, but perhaps Mr. Gorf can use it to trap the black hangman like Mr. Bolton intended to do. You fellas get your clothes and bring mine. I'm gonna call Mr. Gorf. Hello, may I speak with Mr. Golf? Oh, can you tell me where I can find him? It's important. The airport? Okay, thanks. Captain Carson! Captain Carson! Is he dead? No, just knocked out. Get the first aid kit, quickly. But why? The cops are coming here, they'll find him. Then that's true if we don't get out of here. Yes, but we can't leave him in this condition. Did you get Mr. Gold? No, but they said we might find him at the city airport. We'll use Mr. Bolton's car. It's in the garage. We can get rid of these cadet uniforms on the way. Here you are, Danny. The cops! Say, how are we going to get by the cops at the airport? We're not going by any cops. We'll wait right here for Mr. Gold. We know his car. We'll stop him when he leaves the airport. I hope Mr. Gold gets here pretty soon. My stomach thinks my throat's cut. What time was Tanner supposed to reach the airport? He should be there when we arrive. Control. Hey, that plane's in trouble. Looks like he's going to crash. One of the men we chased in that motorboat. How did those cadets get here? I thought we had them tied up at Bolton. It's more of those guys that were with the Black Hangman. Yeah, and they mean business. Let's get out of here. We should let the ambulance take him. But with those snoopy cadets hanging around, we'll take Tanner to his apartment. 
Hey, they don't know we've got this car. Let's follow them. Maybe they'll lead us to the Black Hangman. How about waiting for Mr. Galt? No, if we can find out where they live, it will help Mr. Galt run them down. at your apartment, and Ram and I will go on to headquarters. Get Dr. Bauer and fix you up. Manufacturing company. Closed for the duration. You know those signs look phony to me. Could be the hangman's headquarters. Well, that's what we're going to find out. Jinx and I'll go back to the building, see if we can enter in through the fire escape. Scrap, will you and Zombie go around that side and see if we can get into the basement? Stop to let Tana off, even if he was hurt. I gave them a chance to catch up with us. I don't know about that, but I do know I caught them snooping around outside. Watch them closely. Corby, one upon two of those cadets spying around the lab. Yeah. Don't worry. We'll hold them. Why didn't we discover this before? Yeah, then we wouldn't have had to climb up ten flights on that fire escape. We'll take it up to the top floor and work down. That seems to be the only way we can find them. Corby will be right down. So good. <laughs> 